Hello friends, happy Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, June 6th, and welcome to a new week in my life. <laughs> so I have kind of, so I have quite a bit going on this week, but so yesterday, first of all, I had my hair done. <laughs> I always love it. Um, whenever I get it done, I go to Sue Hardy at the JCPenney Salon here in Ames, Iowa, and every time I go there, I have her straighten it for me. So I just, Oh, I love to have it straight for a little bit. Okay, and then um, so it'll be curly the rest of the week. <laughs> okay, so that happened yesterday. That was Monday. And um, David is off this week. So when I got home from getting my hair done, that took like all morning. I came, I got, and I went, then I went grocery shopping. So when I got home like early afternoon, like I just hung out with David and it was so nice. And we watched that Jack Ryan show and we grilled out and it was just so much fun. And of course, Jacob and Logan were there too, but <laughs> the reason why it was special is because David was there. Uh, he usually works the evening shift and during the summers, he switches to the day shift. So he has this week off right now just to kind of like adjust his schedule gradually so that next week when he goes to the day shift, he's ready for that and it's not such a shock to his system. Okay, so let's talk about what needs to get done today. So two big things that are happening today. Um, first of all, Jacob's coming in to work, so I need to get as many stickers as I can printed for him. We just had our mystery kit sale for the month, uh, so the June mystery kit was on sale this past weekend. And we always do really well with uh, sales when that happens. So I've got to get a lot, as many stickers printed as I can for Jacob. He's coming in today and tomorrow to help me with that. And then tonight I'm having dinner with a girlfriend. Her name is Megan. Um, and she has a son that uh, Logan's friends with. So they're going to have like a little play date while she and I have our like adult play date. <laughs> That's gonna be really fun. I'm, so those are my must do's, is uh, printing the stickers and then dinner with Megan tonight. But my can do's, after I get home from dinner with Megan, if I'm up for it, and hopefully I am, I wanna get back to that side garden, I wanna do a little more weeding, and then I wanna lay down the artificial grass that I have. Um, I've got, I forgot what it's called, I think it's called Claritin. I, it's, it's an over-the-counter like um, thing for, allergies. David suggested I check it out. So I went to Walmart last weekend because I was, you know, I was like kind of miserable towards the end of the week there last week. And the Claritin was like 40 something dollars, but then Target had their like generic one for like nine dollars or like almost 10. It was like, if you round up, it's 10. So I got the generic one. I've never tried either one. So I got the generic one and it's like magic. It totally worked for me. So now I can get back out to the garden and get some more work done. Okay, but first of all, let's get in and let's do these stickers and I will catch up with you guys a little bit later. I think it's dark. Is it dark? It's dark, but it's, it's okay though. It's fine. <laughs> I'm being mysterious in the darkness. <laughs> You're so mysterious. I'm mysterious. Well, if it's dark, then I can be mysterious. Same dark and mysterious. And I'm tall, but I'm sitting. He's tall. So that makes me mysterious. How tall is he? You'll never know. Sitting. <laughs> yeah, that's first. what happens. You sit next to my glorious hair. Yeah. You feel, you feel like your hair's not as glorious. I'm just going to put that clip in. Okay, good. I'm not going to give him any context. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good move. <laughs> So um, I'm back from Megan's and I did not, I am not weeding, obviously. I'm choosing to watch TV with David <laughs> instead. Um, so I didn't accomplish everything on my to-do list today. Shocker. <laughs> Are you saying I'm, I'm not productive? No, I'm saying that your uh, list is far more productive than you can ever be or any human could ever be. I know, my <laughs> lists are ridiculous. She gets about four. Four things, four or five things done a day, and her list is like twenty nine long. So yeah, nice. not thirty because she her her goal is to get to twenty nine so she can make a thirtieth. Yeah, they don't even know. Like I, I just I just share like my top three with them. They don't even know the like extent of my she won't true, allow herself my true list. She won't allow herself a round number until she gets to the non round number. That's what I'm trying to say. Well, I, what it was, I, I can't remember if I told you, but I don't I was, remember. <laughs> But I'm helping Megan. Oh, sorry, my hand. So I'm helping Megan with a project. Unfortunately, we didn't finish the project. I didn't go into detail about the project because it's her own personal thing. But um, we didn't finish it tonight. So I'll be going back next week to help her finish that. And I was going to weed the garden, the side garden, and lay that artificial grass tonight. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. It's like eight o'clock at night. Yeah. yeah. You get that was on your list. That was on my list. She walked in the door at eight. Yeah. <laughs> so instead, after after a thunderstorm, by the way, she's still yeah, gonna do it. <laughs> I know. I did. I did think. I was like, you know, it just rained really hard. Maybe I shouldn't go work in the garden. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> maybe I, I told maybe them. Be, maybe it'd be pointless. We covered in mud, and nothing would actually be accomplished. <laughs> I told them about how you suggested I try that uh, medicine for allergies, yeah. and it totally works. He's, uh, he's full of good advice. I'm full of it. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> okay, so we're going to watch that Jack Ryan show. <laughs> what's it called again? <laughs> I, know, I, told him, I told him how I was telling you guys. I'm like, David, what's the name of the show we're watching? You know the one with Jack Ryan in it? Because I want to tell my viewers the name of the show. And he was like, uh, Jack Ryan? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. I was like, oh, man. <laughs> okay, guys, I'll see you in the morning. Bye. I'll pasta. Hello friends and happy Wednesday. So today is a very busy day for me. Um, so tomorrow is my anniversary with David. We are celebrating 21 years of marriage tomorrow. So I kind of want to leave tomorrow evening open to spend time with him. I think the plan is right now, um, we're going to get takeout from like a nice restaurant, but we're gonna bring it home and eat it at home and continue watching our show. <laughs> so we're really enjoying this show that we're watching, the Jack Ryan show. So anyways, um, so tomorrow I want to only work during the day. So what I'm gonna do today is my, is my to-do list for today. Here's, I've already done some things, but I'm gonna go over this with you. And then if I can, I wanna jump ahead and get started on some of tomorrow's to-do items as well. So let's talk about today's must-dos. And I already started work this morning and I recorded that, so you'll probably see that clip before this. But I want to fill orders. Oh, I already filled orders. So now I need to put get them like all packaged up in the postage and all that. Um, so finish filling orders. I need to print stickers for Jacob because he's coming in to work at three o'clock. When he gets here at three o'clock, I'm gonna take those orders to the bank. And then I have a few other things I need to take care of for the family. But then when he's done at five, cause he's working three to five today, I'm gonna come back to the shop and continue to work. So what I wanna work on when I get back uh, is tomorrow's list. So basically what I have going on this week is I have lots of orders to fill um, because of the mystery kits, which is so cool. But we also have a sticker release coming out on Saturday. So I wanna get a jump start on that and start um, designing those things. My goal is to have everything designed and ready to go by the end of the workday on Friday. That way Saturday when sticker, um, my stickers go like are released for the first time, it, they're all ready to go. So in the, in, like in the recent past, I um, spend all day Saturday designing stickers the day of a sticker release and then I get the sticker release out that night. So I'm, I'm just pushing it one day ahead. That's the goal. Plus Logan just has a very like busy social week this week. He, a lot of, he is, he's going out with a friend on Friday night. He's gonna go to a movie um, with his friend and his friend's mom. And then Saturday he has a couple of friends coming over and I'm gonna be taking them to the pool on Saturday. So uh, he had a play date last night when I was with Megan. Um, so, he, and he has his video game club tomorrow. So he just has a lot going on. <laughs> right now, uh, you know, D David's home this week. So right now he and Logan are out on a bike ride. It's not raining quite yet. It was supposed to, we're supposed to have like lightning and thunderstorms throughout the whole day. So we kind of scrapped some of the things we had on our list today. I was gonna try to get to the garden today, but I'm gonna scrap that because of the weather. And then we were also gonna go to the pool tonight, but we're also scrapping that. So instead, I'm gonna focus all my energy on getting everything done for today and then a jump start on tomorrow. Ah, okay, let's get to back to filling these orders. 
Hi guys, so I just watched that clip back and I thought it was really funny because I keep like looking off here. If you ever see me looking off in this direction, like up and to the right or to the left, I'm not sure how it is on screen, it's it's my right. But um, I'm looking at my calendars. So I'm gonna flip you around because you never see this part of my office. I have two calendars here. I have my, ah, I have my monthly calendar on the wall and then I have my planner sitting here and there's artwork that David um, got for me when I left teaching. Let's see, it's a little freedom poster. A girl leaving the work, the work thing to live her own life. Anyways, so that's what I'm constantly looking at. And I was looking, I was watching the clip, and I'm like, it's so funny. I'm like, instead of looking at you guys, I keep like going over here and like looking at the calendar and pointing to the calendar. And I thought you guys might wonder what I was doing. So that's what I'm looking at. If you ever wonder, like when I'm looking off to the side. I thought this was hilarious. So last night when I was at Megan, David ate all the chips that we had, and I had bought the chips to go with a meal that I was making later in the week. And when he was on his bike ride with Logan, he picked up a couple more bags and brought them home to me with these messages written on them. I thought that was so funny. Just the sight of you when I'm at my weakest point. Makes a world of difference, oh, you make me strong. Pretty little thing, you're a diamond in the rough, shining from within. I can tell that you're tough. Ordering a cup of love, feel it rising up and above. You will always keep my heart and soul strong. Your seeds and watch them grow. The light will always know where to go. Hello, friends, and happy Thursday. So last night, I didn't come back and check in with you again, but last night was so much fun. We ended up having a gorgeous evening. Like it was like yucky and rainy all day, but we had a gorgeous evening. So Logan and I did end up going to the pool. We went to the pool for a couple of hours, and then we came out, uh, came back home, and we. Uh, uh, barbecued with David well, actually he cooked on the grill for us and I made all the sides that's how we do it I need to learn how to use the grill because most of the year you know he's like working second shift and he's not around uh, so getting to grill out is like a special occasion kind of thing but anyways that was fun and then we continued to watch our show last night I'm really loving having David here this week um, it's just it's really enjoyable Oh, and today's our anniversary. We've been married for 21 years. Today, today this morning, David was joking that, uh, and I were joking about how our, our um, anniversary is 21 years old and how it's like finally legal to drink <laughs> and, and that kind of thing. It's, it's of age, it's of legal drinking age. Okay, so what I have going on today, I've already been working quite a bit, it's two o'clock. I promised David that I would stop working by five, if not earlier but I would stop working by five today. So I got up early and I just jumped in and I got to work right away. I've already been to the bank today. I had to run to Target because I needed a charging cord for my camera. I um, already filmed and edited my family budget check-in that's going out today. Um, it's currently, here I'll show you. It's currently processing. Let's see, it's like at 12% there. So when that's done, I will upload it to YouTube. I still need to make a thumbnail for it. And then what I need to get done before five o'clock is I want to, here I'm look, looking down at this. These are all of the stickers that Jacob cut for me yesterday that need to go into orders. So I want to fill all of these orders before five o'clock. I also want to get them to the post office. And then tonight for our anniversary, David and I are having dinner and, and the boys too, <laughs> but it's in celebration of our anniversary. I haven't, we haven't decided what to have yet. I need to go talk to David. I think, I think we'll probably do Texas Roadhouse because it's just like, 
uh, makes everybody happy. Like there's something there for everyone and everyone likes something there. So I think I might do that tonight for, for anniversary dinner. My, my parents sent us money for dinner, which was as our anniversary gift. So um, that, that's nice. And then we're just gonna chill <laughs> the rest of the night and relax. So um, yeah, so that's the plan. That is the plan. So I need to, there's a couple of stickers, not very many, but a few stickers I still need to cut that Jacob just didn't have time to cut yesterday because he had so much to cut. I left him so much to cut yesterday and he also had to work at his other job. So he worked as much as he could for me and then he had took off for his other job. So I'm gonna finish cutting those, get these orders filled, and then um, have my anniversary night with David. Hello friends and happy Friday. So time to get as much done as we can to wrap up the week. So today, um, first I have a video to film, edit, and upload. It's my, it's the, today I'm gonna do the cash envelope stuffing video. We're currently stuffing cash envelopes to get a month ahead for the month of July. So I'm taking my first paycheck in June and stuffing cash envelopes for, um, for July's budget. And after that, I'm going to work on designs today. I wanna to try and get all of the designs that are being released tomorrow, I wanna to get them all done today so that they're done at the beginning of the day tomorrow instead of at the end of the day. <laughs> like I said before, I've often like, spent the day that the stickers are being released, I spend that whole day like trying to design them and get them done. So I'm gonna try and get them done a day ahead of time. That would be great. Unfortunately, I still have open orders in the shop. We're currently at 50 open orders. It was a great week for the shop, so I'm not complaining. I just would like to get that down to zero, and I know that's not gonna happen today because I have to work on the designs. So my plan is tomorrow, when I would normally work on the designs, I'm gonna try and fill those orders and still get them out tomorrow. We'll see how that goes. Okay, let's jump in and get started. Hello guys. So one final update before I say goodbye for the week. So I, it's almost seven o'clock. I have like two minutes till seven. <laughs> I promised David that I would stop working by 7 p.m. today. I finished almost every design. I still have two designs to go. I need to design August um, 223 for the eight and a half by 11 budget kit. And I need to design August 323 for the eight and a half by 11 budget kit. But I have everything else done. And by the time you see this, all of the kits will be out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and share with you this. This is the pattern that David and I created for August. It is going to be August 123, and it's a back to school pattern. So we did um, pastel watercolors, we did books, pencils, like computers, um, and like coffee cups. I love it. I'm just, I'm just so happy with the way it turned out. Also, I wanted to tell you about this really cool um, Happy Mail that I received. And I've already opened one of the bags and used it. In fact, after this, I'm gonna insert a very funny clip of me from this morning making the coffee and me drinking it with my, my bed head. <laughs> you can see how my crazy curly hair looks first thing in the morning. Oh, this, this smells so good. So this is from, um, so this is from a company in Oregon and she actually is one of my viewers and I didn't know she was gonna send this to me. So it was such a nice surprise. When I opened my mailbox, my mailbox smelled delicious. The stuff is incredible. This coffee is absolutely incredible. You'll see in the taste test, I was like, oh. Like, it was so good. But this one is called Feeling Coasty. This is the one I tried today, and this is a hot brew. And then this is a cold brew called Ice Ice Baby, and Bay spelled B-A-Y. <laughs> 
I, I just thought this was so cool. Um, let me see if I can tell you. She also sent me this super cute thing that, like little thing that says let it be, which I can use in videos, like I can do when I do my top down videos. And I think she even sent me a, a discount code. The company is called Chico, chicocoffee.com. There is her business card. And I could have sworn that there was a discount code. Give me just a sec. Yes, okay, so by the way, she's on, on YouTube. Her name is Misty Mother of Truth. And then the discount code is ship free to me and you can get free shipping. So her website is chicocoffee.com. This coffee is amazing. If you like good coffee, I highly recommend you check her out. And I wanna say a big thank you too to Misty for sending me this. It was so, so very thoughtful. Okay guys, check out the morning here. <laughs> I cannot wait to try this coffee. It smells so good. Mm. Wow. I can honestly say I've never had a cup of coffee like that in my entire life. Wow. Okay friends, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this week's video, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you all again next time. Bye everyone. Shimmer on our skin